Hello, hello, my melodies. Welcome back. We are going to get into the three pack of tins and boxes that I ended up getting at Costco when I uh, went out on release day with Nate and Marie. Um, initially wasn't going to buy it. It was uh, $72 and uh, it was just like, I, I don't really want the, I don't need the promos in the tins. 151 ETBs are, you know, they're, they're good, but uh, it's just all the prices are a little bit expensive right now. And then um, we ended up recording or, or checking to see um, how much an actual 151 ETB was being sold for online um, on eBay, TCG Player, stuff like that. And it ended up being that those ETBs were being sold for $75 at the moment. So I was like, well, that's basically the other two tens for free. So any pulls in there are essentially free. It's kind of discounted cards at that point. Um, of course, the, the other boxes in that palette were um, Crown Zenith ETBs. Um, this was one of the last 151 boxes that was left. So somebody who went and searched for the 151 boxes and left this one behind, we'll see what it is um, or what what pulls are in that box. So we're going to open up the uh, Elite Trainer box today of 151, and we're going to open up the uh, two tins in the next video, um, kind of separating them out since there's, uh, there's going to be a lot of packs in this set. Um, so it's, I think total, let's take a look. Total will be, um, we got five over here, we got four. So there's nine in the tens and then nine in the actual ETB. So that works out normally what I like to open at least around nine in each video. So one ETB and then both of the tens. So let's go ahead and break open the, uh, the thing here, my handy pry tool. Of course, the tins that you get are going to be the Maridon tin, so that will be put over here for a later video. And ETB with the Snorlax and that wonderful Snorlax promo artwork. And then Caridon is in the other smaller tin for that. And carefully placing tra trash over there. I do pick it up. I don't make Nikki pick it up. Um, I try and clean up my area when everything is there. Of course, I try and throw the packs away as we do it, because otherwise it's gonna be, it's gonna be too much <laughs> type of thing. Alrighty. Jump in here, of course, it is the normal um, ETB. You get in the outer sleeve, you get some of the artwork in there. You get a checklist for that. We'll put that over there. There's the divider, kind of cardboard, fun, whatever. That's going to go in the trash because I don't ever do anything with it. We have the dice, dividers. Where is it? There's the code card I was looking for. There's a code card for the box. And then, of course, the Snorlax promo. We'll throw that up over there. And then the dice back in there put this etb box back together and over there okay we got one through nine for 151 of course these all have the fun um 151 pokemon in them the original we got chances at blastoise we got chances at squirtles um charmanders charizards bulbasaurs venusaurs all that good stuff mew mewtwo that's where the 151 comes from but before we jump into the packs, we want to do a BPM Zone pack battle, of course. So Battle Professor Mark, we're doing slot number one today. We're doing category number three, which is the Pokedex number, which is convenient since uh, all of them are in 151. Um, and we're looking for the highest one. Okay, so if we pull a Mew or a Mewtwo, they will definitely win the compare card category today. Slot number one, category number two, highest one. Okay. Pack number one, let's jump right on in, have some fun. I do like opening 151, still need a lot of the set to be able to uh, to complete it and stuff. I'm gonna shift, hold on, I shifted everything. I don't know why the, uh, why the table is yelling at me. I do need a new table. Um, if you know any of the, uh, if you know any good woodworkers in Indiana, let me know. I wanna try and build a, a master ball round table so it's it's going to be a circle table but it's got to have like the nubs on it for the master ball i don't know 
that's like my next like wish list project of trying to do something. I'm not a good work, woodworker, so I want to work with somebody. I want to try and commission somebody to do that. Um, we'll see that. I can do uh, I can do anything in IT. I am <laughs> that's my that's my normal day job. Um, I am in IT, so you, you need some software written. I mean, I love PowerShell, but like, yeah, I'm going off on a tangent. Anyway, Polyworld is number sixty one. For the compare card category today, we are also going to try and remember who is winning with the dice counter up here. Got Kakuna, Poliwag, so now we can evolve into our Poliwhirl, Ponyta, Victory Bell, a Big Air Balloon, Primate, Muck, Nidoking, and an Arbok EX. Starting out strong with a double rare. There we go. We got Arbok in the MVP section. Of course, you know what that means. We get to get the party started with Blastoise. Mark's valuable Pokemon card section hanging out up there. We get the lights going. The party is always happening. And uh, yeah, Blastoise always makes sure that all the MVPs, including you, have all of the drinks and snacks that you could want. There is no cover charge to get into the MVP club here. Um, and yes, I think uh, one day in the future, when I, if, if, if I make it anywhere big, <laughs> I'm going to try and run or try and have an MVP party with Slurpee machines going. Cause that like, there's a dream. It's on my vision board. We're going to get there. Um, <laughs> number 17 is not going to take over the compare card category, but yes, you are all invited um, whenever I end up having the MVP party in real life. We got Caterpie, Venonat, and a Mr. Mime hanging out, having some fun. Is this Mr. Mime any, uh, any interest? If this Pokemon and your opponent's active Pokemon have the same amount of energy attached, prevent all damage done to this Pokemon. Okay. And then Psy Power doesn't do enough. So we're not going to put that in any decks. I just wanted to check them. Okay, pack number three. But yeah, we just like to have fun on this channel. Just having silliness going on. We have number 41, 61. Okay, not taking over the compare card. Nidoran there, Ghastly, Golbat, Leftovers for the Snorlax, another Poliwhirl, Rattata, and a Zapdos EX. Okay, got another double rare there for the MVP section. Got some electricity. Now we can run all of the uh, neon lights and fun stuff at the party. <laughs> I do think about that. Do you guys, I mean, I assume you're Pokemon fans, but do you think, do you think through like what, what parts of your life would be easier with what Pokemon? Uh, let me know like which Pokemon you would like to have to make your life easier. I mean, Zapdos being able to ha like conjure electricity and stuff, you could, you could save on your energy bills. Um, like if you have like ice cube or some of the ice water or the ice Pokemon, then you can like save on your chilling food or, uh, or you just got, you got freezer burn on all the things you eat. <laughs> I don't know. Do you, do you ever sit there and just think about how your life would be different if you had Pokemon? I don't know. Uh, 116 for horsey. These are things that I do think about. Um, this is pack number four. So Horsey is taking over the compare card category. Yeah. Let me know. Do you which Pokemon would you think would make your life easier in the comment section? Which uh which Pokemon would you want to try and capture? And you can have a full party. Let's do a party of six. Like what six Pokemon would you want in your life that would just make your life easier? Electricity bills, uh water, food, um green thumb. I don't know. What would you want? Do you need muscle in your life? Like, do you need like heavy lifting? You got a champ to move all your furniture stuff around. Uh, maybe you do woodworking in your business and you have a uh, Pokemon that can help you with that. I don't know. I'm mean, Sudowoodo is coming into mind, but that, that would be, that'd be a little bit weird making, making furniture with a Sudowoodo. Maybe it would work. I don't know. <laughs> We're sitting, I was sitting on the, uh, the Tangela there for fun. I forgot that they have a uh, holographic energy too. So we got a Tangela and a 
holographic lightning energy electric lightning whatever you want to call it it's yellow and i see at least one swirl in there so that's kind of fun okay pack number five There's the code card. Got Paris, number 46. Not taking over the compare card. Sand True. Yeah. Now I'm trying to think through, like, what Pokemon would be very scary for Halloween as well. Is Hall are, you want to have Halloween all year long? You have some ghost Pokemon with you? I've been thinking about that, too. That's kind of fun. We got a Vaporeon for the rare on that one. Let's double checking that the fighting... The fighting didn't have a didn't have a holographic behind it, basically. That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> there is the code card. We got Drowsy number 96, not taking over the comparer card. Bulbasaur, Slowpoke. Um, I actually kind of need to save that Slowpoke for one of my decks. We got Victory Bell, Big Air Balloon, Magnemite, Execute, and Dragonite for the rare there. Uh, pack number seven. There is, oh, well, there is the energy. I grabbed two. Energy, we'll just go ahead and put that down there. We have seal. That is 86, not taking over the compare card category. Got tentacool, ratata, rapidash, nidorina. Eradicate, we can evolve for sure. Primate, Nidorina, and a Nitto King. Okay, well, not exactly the right gender to be able to do that evolution, but I'm pretty sure we pulled the Nidorinos yeah, at some point today. So, pack number eight. I don't know why I just, I did the pause on that number. Pack number eight. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that would be kind of silly and fun, right? Do you ever announce to you what's going on? Do you uh, do you mimic some of your favorite YouTubers on what's going on? I don't know. We have uh, 74 with Geodude, Jigglypuff. If anybody wants to mimic me and my voice, go for it. As long as you're having fun with Pokemon, like, there's no wrong way to have fun with Pokemon. That's, that's my philosophy. We got an Onyx with an I, not a Y. We have Gengar and then another Mr. Mime. Okay. Well, we got three pools. I feel like I, I would like at least one more to make this uh, this purchase worthwhile. But again, you go to those big box stores, I feel like sometimes they are all hits or they are all absolute duds. Sam's Club has been good to us. Come on, Costco. You got you to gotta bring up the, uh, the fire. We need, to, we need to make sure that we have some good stuff. Okay, we're starting out with Squirtle. That's, that's a little bit better. Squirtle is not going to take over the compare card, so pack number four is winning compare card today. Venonat, Pidgey, Erica's Invitation, Magneton, Nidoqueen, Pidgeot, Shelter, and we're ending on a Machamp. Oh, and a Hollow. Okay. Well, I feel like that ETB was a little bit of a dud. I don't know if it's going to be worth $75 or uh, or the the package. We'll see what the other tins give us in the next video to see if the Costco purchase was worth it. But if you're new here, feel free to subscribe, hit that notification bell, join the melodies. Uh, I feel like everyone has their own unique song to sing and we all want to sing in harmony. So come join us, come hang out. We're just having fun as always. So thank you. If you're not new here and you are been here, thank you so much. Every single video and minute that you watch, I really do appreciate it helping, uh, helping this channel grow. I'm having fun with it. I'm going to keep doing it as long as I have fun with all of you. So let's keep, let's keep having fun together. <laughs> Remember to keep singing the song in your heart. And in the end, a little music goes a long way. <laughs>